Memory Owl's Two Times Table Stories. Memory Owl watched Shoe walk along a path with another shoe. The shoes noticed a door on the ground and they jumped up and down on it. The door suddenly opened and they fell down a deep, dark hole. Memory Owl woke up in his tree and decided to visit his friends in the wood. He tried to fly, but his shoe was stuck in the branch. He pulled and pulled and suddenly his shoe came loose and a stick broke off and fell to the ground. Door and Shoe were having an argument about how to keep door open. Door said that Shoe could not keep it open and he, as he was too small, but Shoe didn't agree. Luckily, Crate was walking past and he held door open for them. Memory Owl was talking to his bees next to their hive and noticed that some bees were buzzing around a shoe that was making a clucking sound. Memory Owl flew over to the shoe and out popped a hen. Memory Owl was pretending to be a wizard and wanted to cast a spell. He held the stick and waved it over Shoe. There was a magic puff of smoke and Shoe turned into a teeny shoe. Memory Owl's Shoe visited heaven. He tried to open the pearly gates but they were far too heavy. He pulled and pulled but nothing happened. Shoe looked around and noticed a teeny door. Hooray, said Shoe and went through the teeny door into heaven. Tired Shoe hopped into Crate to go to sleep. He couldn't get comfy because something was sticking into him. He looked around and saw a teeny stick in the corner. Shoe was a bit wet, so wanted to be pegged up on the line to dry, but he couldn't reach high enough. He noticed a teeny crate nearby, and by standing on that he was able to reach. Soon he was dry as a bone. Teeny Shoe could not get to sleep. Shoe suggested counting sheep, but Teeny Shoe had never seen a sheep. Shoe told Teeny Shoe to count plenty of doors instead. Visit memoryowl.com and have 20% off books, flashcards and more.